I know my purpose. European card came with curtains. I have a daughter, I'm buying a baby burger. For the good and got her legs hurting. Find the wave and got them ends early. Sasa nigga from the dirty dirty. These folk got, got their hit his shit. No cap. What's up guys, welcome back to another video on the most lit channel on YouTube. If this is your first time here, please do your boy favor and hit the like button and hit that subscribe button. And do not forget to turn on post notifications. Today we're here at LES and I'm going to teach you guys how to back nose going. Example that I just did a while ago for you. A backside nose blunt is just a backside 180, but you don't even have to turn full 180, you could just turn 90. But make sure you ollie. If you don't ollie, if because it's all in the pop, if you do not ollie, you will not make it over the rail. So you have to make sure your pop is a strong pop. And also you want to try to aim for the nose, the nose of the board, because it's a backside nose blunt. So as y'all riding up. Red master. So, as you riding up, you want to have a good pop, a strong pop. Make sure you over the rail. You know what I'm saying? Like, so don't don't pop as if you're gonna do a 50-50 because you're trying to go past the 50-50 to extend. So you pop a strong ollie, and it's kind of like a late backside 180. I kind of do like a late backside 180, and I get my nose onto the rail just like this. You know what I'm saying? And the rest is all slide. And then coming out can sometimes be hard, but if you practice it enough, you're gonna have coming out of backside nose blunt perfect. It's like just a little nudge out, a little slide. Okay, as you guys just saw in my example over there, I was trying to show you guys that you have to pop like a late back 180. So it's kind of like this. Ollie first and then you turn last moment. That way you can get it into the back nose bar. And so it's not a full 180. It's a 90 degree Ollie you're doing, not a full 180. But it helps to learn back 180. It helps 100%. Basically, you just do that into the nose. Make sure you aim for the nose or it will not be a nose bar. You know, understand what I'm saying? It has to be in the nose. Make, you don't want to hit truck first and then nose blunt. I mean, as you're learning it, if that happens, it's fine. But you, majority of the time, want it to land in the nose because it is called a nose blunt. If it lands on the truck, that's a bad side of Shout out to the cameraman, Steph, barring me up and shit. But that's it for the video, guys. Make sure you watch this video over. If you need to learn something over, rewind it, slow it down, but make sure you have a good pop. Make sure that you're alien high enough over the rail because you're trying to get the nose to be inside of a nose blunt. And then I guess the hardest part is coming out, but once you're in the nose blunt, it'll it'll come easy, trust me. You can get the biggest Chanel back in the store if you want it. I gave them the drill, they sucked it up, I got them on it. I bought a new paddock, I had to watch so I took